Hello guys. Um, I want to review here the YouTube RT application. This is the official uh, YouTube app for um, Windows RT. And this is a paid app. The good thing about this, uh, the store, and I'll show you from uh, Windows RT is that basically any, any app that is paid, you can try it before you buy it. Uh, for example, uh, we go top paid. Let's say this one right here, just to give you an example. <clears throat> well, this one is not showing. Most of the apps are showing. Let's see this one. Okay, so as you can see here, it says buy and then it says try. So basically, you can try it. I think it's like seven days. Uh, most of the apps are fully functional because I already tried many apps. And um, after the seven days, you know, if you want to buy it, fine. If not, then you can delete it or uninstall it. <clears throat> so the reason I'm telling you this is because it was the same thing with YouTube. Um, I, you can access YouTube by uh, using the, the browser or the Explorer browser. And uh, you can actually pin that to your uh, desktop or your start menu, which I already did here. So if I click on this, it's going to take me to YouTube. But this is not, um, I guess if I can say, friendly user uh, when it comes to touch. It's not optimized for, for use it as a touch app. Uh, you can still use it uh, with the... As you can see, I have the dock keyboard. So, you know, I can still use the mouse and all that. I use uh, this uh, regular ver version of YouTube, like if I'm using a laptop computer. I can use my fingers too, but it's a little bit difficult because it's not meant to be used as a touch app. So, like, if you, uh, I don't know, if you want to go to... Uh, Let's see, you want to open a video or whatever, you know, click on that. And it's going to open the video, but the thing is that, see, if you want to change it, you want to change the resolution, it's a little bit difficult because it's so small, and then you might... Uh, tap on something else or not or you have to tap more than twice on the same thing to be able to get what you want so uh i was looking for an actual uh youtube app for uh windows rt and i was able to find this app so here's how it looks like it says youtube rt and uh hopefully this video helps because i think i found one review and not to criticize the, the person, but it was just like a minute or two. And it was uh, just showing like the interface. So anyways, guys, um, this is how it looks like once you uh, open the app. Uh, I'm already signed in, but basically uh, you can customize your home screen by uh, uh, showing you recommended videos, newer subscriptions, top rated, top favorites, watch history, and uh, I think it gives you, yeah, a couple of more options. Trending, recently featured, most shared, and so on. So going back, uh, let's see. Okay, so I believe, I don't know if, I, if I'm going to be able to access it now because I think I think you can do it when you are signing in, but you can basically set if you want your videos to be open in a standard resolution. Uh, I, think, uh, it gives, I think it gives you the option to 360, 480, 720, and 1080. So like I was telling you, using the regular 
browser application, you have to manually do it. With this app, it's already you can already set, set that up. So every time you open a video, it's gonna open in the resolution that you want to. Um, since also it lets you sign in into your account, then you're gonna sh it's gonna show you all you all your uh, uploads. You can do my playlist. It's gonna show you your subscriptions. Uh, it's gonna give you recommendations uh, depending on your profile. So. As you can see here, it says new newest subscriptions, top rated, top favorite, watch history, that's cool, uh, trending, and so on. So, just to give you an idea, let's say let's click on a recommended one. So, click on this here. And then basically you tap one more time on the video and it's gonna uh, show the full screen. Um, if you wanna go back, there, and there might be a way, I'm not quite sure yet, but if you wanna go back, I realize that you there's no, oh yeah, okay, okay, there it is, okay. So you um, flip, uh, up the screen and then it gives you the arrow to go back so you go back and then look at the cool thing on this app the video keep playing right here in the corner you can uh, go back you can forward you can pause it I'll pause it so the cool thing about that feature that you know Android doesn't have that feature uh, or even if you go to the regular browser and use YouTube, it doesn't give you that feature. You can keep watching a video here while you're browsing other videos, subscriptions, whatever. Uh, or, you know, if it's something that you're not sure if you're going to like it or not, you know, at least you can have that little preview there um, as you're browsing other things. So, so that's that's cool with that. Um other than that, guys, um, let's see here. If I go to my uploads, it's going to show all my, my videos. Go back here. Subscriptions. It's going to show all my subscriptions. And, of course, if you click on the subscriptions, it shows you all the videos. Um, also, after you watch a video, uh, you or during watching the video, or, or at, at any time while you're watching the video, you can uh, do the likes or dislikes. Uh, if you click on the actual name of the of the channel. It gives you the option to uh, click on uploads, playlists, uh, subscribe or unsubscribe. Um, oh, I'm sorry, I want to show you one more thing. Now. So, if you scroll to your to your right, you're gonna see the comments for that particular video, and then you're gonna see related. So that's also pretty cool. Uh, other than that, guys, uh, I think that's about it. Uh, it's a really cool app. I believe it was like two dollars and forty nine cents or something like that, and it was wor it's worth it to buy it uh, because it gives you that touch uh, option. Uh, it makes it easier to navigate to, you know, watch YouTube and all that on your Windows RT tablet. Um, the only thing, the only thing that I think you're not able to do with this app, it's uh, upload a video and and you don't need to, you don't have to, because for that, you know, you're gonna use the regular browser and you're gonna go to YouTube. But other than that, I think that's the only thing you're not able to do. So 
that's all for right now, guys. Uh, it's uh, the application YouTube RT for Windows RT. Uh, really cool app, fully functional, really nice interface, easy to use. And uh, I think it's really worth it. So that's all for right now. Thanks for watching, guys.